Build the story bridge together. Which story will you tell us, Granny? asked Nelly. Which story? Which story? I'll tell the story about Nelly and the present, said Granny. Nelly was pleased. Yay! You didn't finish it last night. It was too late, and your uncle had such a busy day, said Granny. Now, I wonder who likes stories, asked Granny. Everyone did. And I wonder who likes presents. Everyone did. My story is about a little girl who had no money. She wanted very much to give her father a present to show how much she loved him. She thought and thought, but she didn't know what present she could give him. I'd give him a hat. I know, Granny. I know what she gave him. The little girl worked hard and she made a beautiful book for her father. But guess what? asked Granny. What? asked the children. That little girl had two presents for her father. What else did she have? asked Nellie. What did she have, Granny? asked the other children. Well, said Granny, like Nellie, she had a beautiful book and she could read it to her father. That was her other gift. She could read. Like me, like me, like me. Where are you going to put your beautiful book, Nelly? asked Granny. On the bookshelf, said Nelly. Then I can read it again later. Put mine there too, Nelly, said Lele. I'll read my story to Dad. He will like my present, said Nelly. Mine too, said Lele. Please, will you tell us one more story before we go to bed, Granny? begged Nelly. The one about a boy, about a big, brave boy who fought with lions and got away, said Lucy. Once upon a time, there was a big, brave boy, said Granny. Called Vusi, said Nelly. Called Vusi, said Granny. He loved stories about lions, especially his Granny's stories. Those are the best ones, said Vusi. The very best, said Nelly. She felt happy and warm listening to her granny. I'll tell this one to my teacher tomorrow, she thought, just before she fell asleep. The end.